This will make you successful. Constant and never-ending improvement. What is up my winning friend? My name is Zach and welcome back to another video and today I'm going to share with you Canny. How to develop constant and never-ending improvement. Canny. Yeah, we're getting started right now. I had a point in my life where I just really wasn't striving to develop or uh, striving for more. I was just kind of just bummed out in the dumps, just going through the motions in life, never really like having a, a, a purposeful goal to strive for. And it came after I got fired from a clothing store for being a convicted felon. And I started making excuses as to why I would never have anything in my life, throwing a pity party and uh, just let down a bad path. And I started drinking heavily and uh, I just, it, I wasn't in the good mindset. I was in a dark place and I had twin sons on the way and all I'm doing is going out, waking up at, you know, 10 or 12, 10 in the morning, 12 in the afternoon and started drinking immediately with a buddy of mine and all we're doing is going out partying each and every night, saying that's like 2 to 3 in the morning, drinking, uh, just throwing my life away, not really trying to do much with it at all except for party. And that led, you know, I got a DWI and went back to prison. And, and I missed my sons being born by 20 days and that was like, mm, it was a gut punch, man. It was one of the worst things I ever experienced in my life, you know. I mean, can you imagine missing your own children being born? If you have, I, I'm sorry for you because I know how that feels and it's not a good feeling. It's something you will never get back. You know, but at the same time, I'm thankful for it because it made me who I am today and it brought me upon the path that I'm on now. And uh, since I dedicated my life to constant never ending improvement, uh, great things have happened in my life. And I'm gonna share with you how to develop that and why it's so important. And before we get into these tips on how to develop constant never ending improvement, if you want some more tools that are gonna help you crush your goals and just dominate life, head on over and download my free Goal Getter Cheat Sheet. You can do so by clicking that card right there. I'll also link it up in the description. All right, canny, constant, and never ending improvement is not instantaneous. It, it doesn't happen overnight. You know, and I, I laugh when I hear people like, oh, he got lucky, or he's an overnight success story. Uh, when they talk about whoever, it could be about me, it could be about whoever. It's funny to me because nothing is just an overnight success story. That's, that's just what they see. They don't see the years of all the work and, and the grind that you put into it. You know, and, and Kenny, it's the same thing. You know, it's it's a gradual, slow, but constant improvement day in and day out that eventually leads to quantum leaps of success. Just stay focused on what you can do each and every day to improve. Always, you know, it's about those baby steps. You know, everybody wants to do something overnight, wants to stuff instantly because we live in a world of instant gratification. You know, we have all this information at our fingertips on our cell phones and uh, we, we can just, you know, these video games, uh, Facebook, you know, likes instant gratification. All that stuff is uh, literally destroying us in certain ways or another. But if you just constantly put in the real work, the groundwork, the necessary baby steps each and every day fight closer and closer towards your goals you can make incredible things happen in your life and it starts by just doing it day by day week by week month by month just constantly moving towards your goal and, and most people they're afraid of, of losing what they already have you know that they, they, they won't try new things because they're scared of losing what they already have but you know, you can't be in that mindset. Don't ever get yourself in a mindset, oh, I got to protect whatever I have. Like, that is a losing mindset, you know, because if you're so worried about you could possibly lose this, and eventually over time you will lose it if you're just trying to hang on. But if you're striving to grow, not hold on, grow, that's when magic happens. I mean, look at it like the uh, boxing champion, you know, that goes into the ring with the underdog, and the underdog knocks him out and takes his belt. Because because the underdog, uh, in most cases, you know that's just a figurative you know metaphor I'm using. But the underdog, they don't have the championship. They're hungry and they, they want it and they're fighting for it. Whereas the the boxing champion, you know, he's getting kind of lazy. He's not really on his game because you know he's already got the championship. You know, and he's just fighting to hold on to it. He's not fighting for anything else. You always got to find something to fight for. You can't be fighting to defend something. You got to be fighting 
for something. Instead of worrying about losing your belt in life, go out and attack life with your belt, trying to leave a legacy. Attack it from every single angle you can to leave a legacy. And that's the key to candy and the key to winning. If you enjoyed this video and you want to watch more videos that are going to help you crush your goals, dominate life, make sure you head on over and check out this playlist right there. And if you know anybody that just, you know, needs to put in more effort into their lives, that needs to step it up, uh, that could use this video that you, that you care about, that you want to help, share this video with them. You never know what the right message for the right person at the right time can do. And that's what we're all about right here on Women's Day, and I appreciate you. And as always, if you want to dominate your life, make sure you hit the subscribe button and tap the bell notifications. That way, you don't miss anything. Thanks for watching, my winning friend. I will see you next time.